going on, everybody? My name is Mike Carluch, and I help you to stand out from the crowd on social media as opposed to being a sheep in a herd and instead be the eagle that is flying over the herd of sheep. And today I have a very special episode for you guys because this is something that is extremely powerful that you can take immediately that a lot of people in your market probably are not doing. They are overlooking it because they just want to be smart and they just want to shove a bunch of information down people's throats. And we're not going to do that, right? We're going to do it different. We're not going to say the same things that everybody else is saying to the exact same people. We are going to provide unique insights and breakthroughs to these people because that is what they are thirsty for. And you are going to be like Superman and swoop up all of that viewership. But first, before we get into that, I want to bring up 7.luchimedia.com, S-E-V-E-N.luchimedia.com. If you want seven assets that can sell for you for the rest of your life, until the day that the internet blows up and dies forever, and you want those seven assets to be posted in a multitude of different areas again and again over the next few years that reach tens of thousands or even hundreds of thousands of people that you are trying to target, go to 7.lochimedia.com. Now, anyways, let's get into this very important concept that you can take and use immediately on social media. And you absolutely should because a lot of people in your market are simply not doing it. A lot of people in your market, like the other people in your market, a lot of them probably think that they are competing with other people. They're competing with somebody else. Somebody else is stealing their viewership. If somebody's watching somebody else, then they are losing a viewer or something like that. Like they, they think in that like scarcity mindset. But I'd like to offer you a new perspective that just completely destroys that. And you, you shouldn't even be thinking about that in the first place because it's completely untrue. And the thing that you're competing with is not people. You're not competing with other people. You're com- other content creators. You're competing with the beliefs that the viewers have about what you're saying to do in your videos, right? So if they don't believe that they can do something and you don't get rid of those beliefs, then they're not going to watch your video. They're not going to take action on what you're saying. And therefore, if they don't take action and get results on what you're saying, they're probably never going to buy your product, right? So you need to give them a way to feel confident in themselves that they can take action on what you're saying in your videos. And how do you do that? You have to address all of those concerns that they have, you know, You know your market the best. So if you know your market, if you know the conversation that your customer or your viewer is having in their mind, then you need to go into their mind and and just address the questions and concerns and doubts that they have in themselves. Now, let me give you an example. One of the people that I love to learn from is Frank Kern, and he's like an advertising guy on social media. And let me tell you something. I've always had my doubts about advertising, about using Facebook ads manager and all of these different things. I've had those doubts for literally years, and I never thought to like go and do it just because I thought it was like way too complicated. And every single YouTuber that I would go and watch uh, just like you were saying the same exact thing over and over again, like showing all these technical things, using all these technical terms. And I had no idea what the hell they were talking about. And therefore I never did it. And that limited me. And if I wish, I wish I found Frank Kern like five years ago or something like that when I was getting started in internet marketing, you know? And so when I found Frank Kern, the first thing that he says is, Hey, You can do this. You can run this type of ad that I'm going to show you today. Even if you've never ran a Facebook ad before, even if all this techie stuff seems complicated to you, I'm going to show you that it's not complicated at all. And when I heard that, I was like, okay, I'm going to give this guy a shot because I've never heard anybody say that before. And guess what? He made it in a way where it was stupid simple. It was the easiest thing ever. I'm like, oh my God. You know, I put off advertising on Facebook for five years Because of this, because of this little process, it's just that the words that the people were using in the videos that I was watching beforehand were so complicated that I didn't, they didn't even register in my mind and they weren't telling me that I could do it even if I was a beginner, you know? And then Frank Kern comes out of nowhere and he says, oh, this is stupid, simple. This is simple. And then I have those ads that I've been trying to run for five years up within 20 minutes. Isn't that crazy? Just think about that. Think about how many breakthroughs that you can give to the people that watch your videos. If you just take that concept, if you just say, okay, it doesn't matter if you're blank, if you're blank, if you're blank, you can still do this. And I'm going to show you how to do it stupid, simple in a way that you can actually understand. Think about if you did that in every single one of your videos, how many more people like me and Frank Kern would actually watch your videos? Think about that.